Hey guys, I have a mixed match versus Rigo four five six from the Poker Ladder. Um, we decided to do three OUs in this mixed match instead of two. Uh, it was his preference. I didn't really care either way. So here we go. It leads off with a pincer. I lead off my Tyranitar, thinking it would have like close combat or brick break or something. I switch out and go to my Hypno. And he does have superpower, so I'm glad I switched. Um, that doesn't really do a whole lot. But thinking he probably has like X Scissor or, you know, something like that. I go for, I think I go for Reflect. No, I just Thunderwave him. Um, so I can go first just to get some Paralyze on him. In case I, I think I did it so if I switch back on my Tyranitar, I'd be faster. But I go for a Wish. Uh, not sure how much damage you could do. And I get a pair of hacks on him. So that that helps, but I know it's it kind of sucks. But I go for a Reflect. And he goes for an X Scissor. And it does a lot, even after the Reflect. So I'm glad I set up the Reflect when I did. And I get my Wish, and I'm back to almost full. And I think I just, yeah, I just seismic toss him. And he gets parahaxed. So if I remember correctly, this seismic toss can take him out, considering how much it did last time. Yep, and that takes out his pincer. Um, my hypno does really well in this match for me, so I'm really glad I brought it. And he goes into a Dragonite, and he just goes straight into the Outrage. Which is, is good for me, because it locks him into it. Um, I wasn't sure if he had a Lumberry or not, so I just I go for the Thunder Wave. Because uh, if he does have a Lumberry, it'll get rid of the Paralysis, but he'll still get confused once his Outrage finishes. And I just go for the Wish, so that even if he kills this and does damage to my next one, I'll have uh, a Wish out. And it takes out my Hypno, so that, that kind of sucks, because I was thinking he'd do more. Uh, and the Reflect fades now, so that kind of sucks. And I just go to my Weavile to Ice Punch it, and that's going to take out the Dragonite. So, yeah, I'm glad I got that out of the way. When I saw that thing come out, I was, oh, man, I was worried for a little while. But my wish comes true, and my Weavile's back to full health again, and... He switches out to his uh, Umbreon. I could have stayed in and just, I guess, I could have stayed in and Ice Punch to get some damage on him, but I didn't know what he was going to do. Uh, so I switched to my Tyranitar, and he crunches, or he curses up. And I go for the Superpower, and I thought, I don't know, even with one curse, it did a decent amount of damage, so I thought I could two-hit KO it. Um, even with the attack drop. And he has Iron Tail, which that was like a really big surprise. Because I think that's like the first Umbreon that I've seen with an Iron Tail other than the one that I have. So it was, I don't know, it, that surprised me a lot. Um, and I thought this superpower could take him out. But I guess the leftovers were covered just enough for him to survive. Um, and he paybacks and that's going to take him out to Ranitar. Um, but I think... The Sandstorm takes out his Umbreon, so yeah, we're just kind of trading one for one right here now. But I'm just I'm glad I got that Umbreon out of the way. I don't even want to know what other moves it had. But he goes to a Rhyperior, and uh, I just go to my Hill on top to fake out, just because it's free damage. And I'm not sure if it's defensive or not. Uh, I just go for the Rapid Spin to get the the rocks up. And he rock polishes, and I figured he would, because almost every Rhyperior does it. That's the only reason I stayed in for the Rapid Spin. But now I go for the Mock Punch, and it does quite a bit. So, I'm not sure. I th I'm thinking maybe it doesn't have solid rock or something, or maybe it's not defensive. Um, I'm not really sure what that what's up with that, but it Mock Punch did quite a bit. So I go for another Mach Punch. And he has a Citrus Berry. So that was... That was kind of... Weird. I, that's the first time I've seen someone use one. 
outside of like n not fully evolved matches. But I go for another mock punch after he rock polished again. He goes for the earthquake, and I'm pretty sure I can survive. And but I don't. So, but hit him on top did a decent job at softening up his uh right here. I switched to. Uh, we while and I wasn't sure if I should ice punch or not, and I sat there waiting for a while. Um, but I know rock isn't weak to ice, and I wasn't a hundred percent sure if ground was, so I just I switched out to my earth to my cloister just as kind of death fire, seeing if he could kill it. And I completely brought the wrong cloister. I have one that's more defensive than that one. That one's not a defensive cloister. So I'm thinking this. I don't know. He goes for the mega horn and misses, which. Saved my ass. And my Celebi just grass knots and takes out his Rhyperior. So, and after how much damage it did, I'm really thinking maybe it didn't have solid rock. I don't know. So, he goes into his own Tyranitar. And I just go for the Leech Seed just to see what it's going to do. And he crunches. And that does a lot. Um, I mean a lot. But I see the Life Orb damage, so I know he's got a Life Orb. And I know it's not banded, so that sucks. But I get Leech Seed recovery. so But I know I can't take another crunch, so I go for a recover. Just to kind of stall it out, because he's going to do damage to himself. He Stone Edges. I don't know why. I guess maybe hoping for a crit. Um, but it, doesn't, it does about half. So... <clears throat> I probably should have switched out my Celebi, but I thought maybe I could take it out. Um, I just go for another recover to go back up to full. Because I'm just, I, I wanted to make sure I could kill this with one Grass Knot. Because if I lose my Celebi, I'm, I'm pretty much screwed. So I make sure he's at about half health before Grass Knotting. Just to make sure I can kill it in case it was like Sassy, sassy Nature with Special Defense or something. Because um, my Celebi has no Special Attack EVs at all. So I go for the Grass Knot now, and that will take out his Tyranitar. So, I'm glad I got that out of the way. My Celebi's still alive, with a decent amount of health, so I'm not too worried about what he ever he switches into. And he switches into his own Celebi. And he Energy Balls, so I'm thinking maybe it's Specs or something. But it doesn't really do a whole lot, so I recover. And we're both taking damage, yeah, yeah. And he's Psychics. So I know it's not Specs, and it doesn't have Life Orb or Leftovers Recovery or any of that. So, I'm I'm not sure what it has. I'm, I was trying to think about what it had. And the only I was thinking about switching in on Weavile. Um, because he alternates between Energy Ball and Psychic back and forth. So I'm like, maybe if I switch into my Weavile on a Psychic, um, I can Ice Punch it. But I was like, if it has the Ice Berry... Then I'm screwed because he can just take out my Weavile. Um, so I just keep my Celebi in to wear it out a little bit. To make sure that e even if he had the Ice Berry, I could take it out with an Ice Punch. But he Energy Balls and gets a crit. It does quite a bit. And I just Grass not to get damage on him. Uh, I'm not sure if this one has Recover or not. So he Energy Balls again. And seeing how fast he was, I'm thinking it's a, it was a special sweeper type Celebi. You know, like max special attack, max max speed or something like that. Um, but I just go for the recover to get some HP back. And he's psychics. And now he's he's almost at about low enough that I can take it out, even if it had an ice berry. So I just go for another grass not to get more damage on him. And I think here I just let my Celebi die. Yeah, I just let it die so I can bring in my Weavile. Because um, he's at about half health now. and he, I, Even with the Ice Berry, I could take it out with a uh, Ice Punch. So that will take out his uh, Celebi. Um, he ended up telling me, I think if I remember right, he told me afterwards that it had a Pattaya Berry on it which was odd, so uh, 
Great match, uh, Rigo. I hope to have a rematch sometime. I'll read, comment, subscribe, guys.